Don't act like you forgot. Hello, 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 babes. Welcome back to the channel. If you are new, welcome, welcome, welcome. So in today's video, we'll be talking about the beautiful, baby-faced, underrated, multi-talented singer slash actress, Ryan Destiny, who has the star quality to be a huge superstar. So let's get into it. Ryan Destiny Irons was born January 8th, 1995 in Detroit, Michigan to Dawn Irons and Deron Irons. Destiny's father was a part of a 90s R&B group named Guess, who she is inspired by and gets inspiration from till this day. At the young age of 12, while attending junior high school, she formed a musical trio, New Limit, and was managed by her mother Dawn. The trio auditioned for America's Got Talent in 2010. They made it to the third round of the competition before deciding the timing and talent contest rules didn't fit with the girls' goals, said Ryan's mom. By 2011, Ryan had signed with Universal Republic, and the group would later split with Ryan and her manager holding auditions forming a new group called Love Dollhouse. The trio signed to All Def Capital Records, a label partnership with Russell Simmons, Steve Rifkind, and Brian Robbins. In 2014, the group released their debut single, Can I? However, in 2015, the group would disband. Now, why did Love Die House break up? We literally, we just talked it out. One of the girls that was here when we got interviewed here, she uh, left and then we replaced her. And then, yeah, we just had a talk. And we were like, that was like the fourth person <laughs> that like went in and out of the group. Mm. So we were just like, you know what? It's not happening. In 2016, Ryan announced plans for a solo EP. She released her first single, The Same, in 2018, with the remix featuring rapper Toby Lou being released the following year. So it's clear that Ryan loves making music and records that fulfill her and what she identifies with, which is much like the people who she looked up to as inspirations in the music industry, such as Michael Jackson, Prince, Brandy, Aaliyah, and more who took their craft serious and weren't about gimmicks but true talent. In 2010, Ryan appeared in an episode of the web series The Wannabes starring Savy. In 2011, she traveled to Los Angeles with her mother to start auditioning for other projects in order to advance her career. In 2013, she appeared in several episodes of the Detroit-based crime drama, Low Winter Sun. Ryan would later appear as the lead in the independent film, A Girl Like Grace, opposite Garcelle Bouvet, Megan Good, and Raven Simone, playing a 17-year-old who is raised by a single mother, who is bullied and seeks guidance from her best friend and her older sister and gets caught up in the fast life. Ryan initially booked the role of Tiana on Lee Daniel's hit musical drama, Empire, but due to her contract with Old Deaf Music at the time, she could not accept the role. However, in December 2015, Ryan booked one of the lead roles as Alexandra in Lee Daniel's series, Star, opposite Queen Latifah. The series premiered on Fox December 14, 2016, but in November 2019, it was announced that Star was canceled and unfortunately ended after three seasons, with one of the most horrible cliffhangers to a show, might I add. I wish that Lee Daniels made a show that was centered around Ryan Destiny rather than having her to play the background singer and dancer when she was more talented than both of the singers in the show, even with her trying to hold back her ability to outshine them for the show you saw the star quality that she had ryan should definitely be one of hollywood's it girls not just because of her beauty but her sheer confidence and it girl factor that she has. But we know when you don't do and bow down to certain things, then you will be blocked in certain areas of your career. If you aren't overly sexual and act a certain kind of way, then you won't go far in the industry. And Ryan is one of those humble, classy, non-compromising girls who isn't going to sell herself 
just to make it in Hollywood. And I believe it's better to not sell yourself and hold on to your integrity and stand on your beliefs than to reject what you believe in just for money and fame. And all money isn't good money, regardless of how much it is. Some money comes with darkness attached to it, and once you accept it, you remove the protection that God has on you. I do, however, love Ryan's style. I think she has a great sense of fashion, and she knows what colors complement her best and takes full advantage of that. She wears a lot of rich colors as well as warm and neutrals that brings out her beautiful complexion. She is just the it girl to me and I think that she should be bigger in Hollywood. However, in a way I'm kind of glad that she isn't big in Hollywood because I feel it's because she hasn't sold herself and that she holds close to her her integrity and her morals. Unlike a lot of celebrities that we see come in the industry, especially in today's times, you know, there are so many of the same exact acts, music, performances that go on in the industry as of now and there's barely any positive representation of black women in the industry except for a very few a handful actually who are people that you can look up to who you can listen to their music freely and you don't feel kind of dirty when you're listening to some of the things that they're saying in their music and that's no shade to some artists However, I love clean, good R&B music, which is the type of music that Ryan makes. And one of my favorite songs that she has released recently was How Many. I've played that song so many times. She just has this beautiful, soulful voice. It's not overdone. She doesn't do an extreme amount of runs. She just has this beautiful, crisp tone that I just love. If I'm riding, you go striding. And she's really like a human brat stall. She is so gorgeous. She just has this mesmerizing beauty. Ugh, gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous girl. But that is it for this video, guys. I will catch you guys in the next video. Don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe. Make sure your notification bells are turned on so that you always know when I upload. Liking helps the algorithm, as I stated before. And I will catch you guys in the next video.